Here's a look at your news headlines for Wednesday, March 11th, 2015 on 1690 WJGP Wolverine Radio. I'm Kevin Dunn. A new medical center is coming to Plainfield. Developers hope to break ground in the spring. The plans call for a two-story, 40,000-square-foot facility. Plainfield's Planning and Zoning Committee approved the permit for the project earlier this week. The center, the Bacchus Center for Specialty Care, will provide medical, rehabilitation, a women's health center, and an ambulatory surgery center. If you're job hunting, Plainfield Business Association will host a job fair tomorrow at the Plainfield Town Hall. Although the job fair this year has fewer participants, there will be many larger companies that didn't take part in last year's event. Foxwoods, Electric Boat, Day Kimball, and Bacchus Hospitals will be available to residents as well as the Jewett City Savings Bank and local manufacturing firms. Last year's event drew nearly 300 people. This year they're expecting close to 500. Residents that are coming for employment are asked to come as if you're going to an interview. Dress appropriately and bring a resume. United Community and Family Services has served Griswold through a small office from downtown Jewett City for the last seven years. That's all going to change very soon, as UCFS broke ground yesterday on a new facility at the former plastic wire and cable site on East Main Street. The new 10,000-square-foot facility will include the already provided services, but will now include dental, pharmacy, behavioral, and expanded primary care services. UCFS expects to spend almost $2 million on the new facility, in which they're still awaiting grants. On hand for the groundbreaking yesterday were UCFS President Chuck Seaman, State Representative Paul Brickey, First Selectman Kevin Schoolcheck, and Second Selectman Steve Mikutel. Construction is expected to begin in one year. Wolverine Radio News is being brought to you by Eastern Savings Bank with branches in Jewett City, Plainfield, and Norwich. Sports and weather, next. Eastern Savings Bank's Simply Free Checking account has no minimum balance, no monthly service charge, just free checking with no hidden strings. Simply Free Checking also comes with free e-statements, free online banking, bill pay, and mobile banking, so you can bank whenever, wherever you like. Stop in and open your Simply Free Checking account today. With offices in Norwich, Jewett City, and Plainfield, Eastern Savings Bank, because it matters. Other account fees may apply. Carrier data and messaging fees may apply. Member FDIC. Here's a look at Wolverine Radio Sports. A light schedule in the NHL. The Bruins are off and coming home for a game tomorrow night against the Tampa Bay Lightning. Face off at 7. The Rangers are in action skating against the Capitals in D.C. at 8 p.m. there. In the NBA, the Celtics host the Grizzlies, and the Nets are on the road in Miami. The Knicks get the night off. After bringing back Darrell Rivas, the Jets are reportedly working on a trade with the Houston Texans for quarterback Ryan Fitzpatrick. And the Jets are also the clear leader to sign running back Antonio Cromartie. Here's your 1690 WJGP weather forecast for Griswold, Plainfield, and Jewett City. Sunny for the rest of the afternoon, high 52. For tonight, partly cloudy, the overnight low of 28. For tomorrow, Thursday, sunny high of 42. Thursday night, clear skies, and the temperatures dropping down to about 8 degrees. Friday, it warms back up to 42 under sunny skies. Friday night, clouds move in with a low of 29. And looking ahead to your weekend, Saturday starts it off rainy and 44. And that's what's happening, updated and accurate. Rely on us for local news on the air at 1690, on the TuneIn app for your tablet or smartphone, and always online at mygriswald.com. I'm Kevin Dunn, Wolverine Radio News.